Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to jailbreak any iPod Touch or iPhone on firmware 3.1.2. Okay, so there's a few things I wanted to tell you guys before we get started. For the third generation iPod Touch, this only works for a tether jailbreak. Uh, for those of you who don't understand what that is, I will have the whole meaning of that in the description. Okay, so let's get started. You're going to need only one thing for this, uh, so it's pretty easy. You're going to need a file called Black Rain. And um, and to get that, you go to this website, blackrain.com, and this will be the website. You scroll down to the bottom. If you have an, a Mac, you just click the Apple, and if you have Windows, click the window sign, and the file will start downloading. That's all you need to do. Okay, so once you download your file you need for Mac or Windows, then you click Black Rain. Okay, so once you have it open, just keep your iPhone or iPod Touch connected to the computer on the latest firmware, which is 3.1.2. And you can even update it through iTunes, it doesn't matter, it's all the same. And then once you do that, just click make it rain, and the whole thing will get started. So once you click let it rain, it's going to do its stuff, it takes about two minutes. I've already done it to make sure it all goes well, and it's working fine. Okay, so once you do that, you'll see on your iPhone the picture um, of what we saw, which will be this. You'll see the picture on your iPhone, and then um, after it goes away, your iPhone should reboot, and you should have a program like this it's called black rain all you need to do is open it so once you click on it you'll come to a screen like this and then once you get to that screen you're going to need to install Cydia you don't really need to install the other ones uh, Cydia is the main one that people use because it's the best one and most reliable um, but you can do whatever you want but I suggest uh, installing Cydia only so once you once you click on Cydia and click install it will start installing and unpacking Cydia then once it finishes, your iPhone will reboot, and uh, once it reboots, you will see uh, Black Rain and Cydia. Now, in order to get rid of Black Rain, you're going to open it up again in your iPhone, and you're going to go back in, and like you see in this picture, uh, you're just going to need to click the button by the by the uninstall, and you'll see an arrow next to it. All you have to do is click delete, and it will uninstall Black Rain from your phone, and you only have Cydia. So that's basically the whole thing. It's a real easy process. And if you guys want to subscribe, I'll have all the latest jailbreak videos on the latest firmware. So be sure to do that. See you guys next time.